Hey guys, JBNI is here, and welcome back to Ratchet and Clank. Now, here is, is the last backtracking episode of this Let's Play. Now, here it starts in on Planet Calibo 3. Now, alright, let's begin. Okay, the first thing I'm going to show you is a gold bolt that is located on on the grinding part of this planet. Okay, to get that gold bolt, you, you have to be sure to activate that switch that you just saw me activate. Okay, activating that switch will lead you to this rail over here. And activate that switch too. Okay, I think I just went in a circle. Let me, um, let me go again and see if I really can get that gold ball. Yeah, I can tell I just went in a circle because I just passed by to activate switches. Hold on, or maybe I jumped on the wrong rail. But I think, but I think you still do have to jump on that rail, um, to activate those switches. Yeah, because maybe if I didn't jump on that rail, um, but, yeah, the path to, oh, okay, I'm about, you're about to see it anyway. Yeah, the path to that, um, rail wouldn't be open. Yeah, so, yeah, so, so do make sure you, um, you jump on to that rail you saw me jump on. And... The gold bolt is... I think it's coming up. Yeah, there it is, right there. Yep, that's the gold bolt. Now, similar to Italia, the Calibo 3 does have a skill point where um, you have to... Oh yeah, where you have to do the grinding section of this planet without taking damage. Now, I skipped over to where I actually did do it, because, um, because I kept unveiling, but I thought I would cut that out, because that would be such a waste of time. I mean, imagine if I were, if I, imagine if I was doing this, like, ten years ago. I believe there was a time limit for, like, uploading YouTube videos. Yeah, because, um... Yeah, because I've seen Sure Conroy upload some of his videos, and and he had to uh, upload um, within a time limit, and then and then he that's why he had to cut some of his videos off, and then he was like, blame YouTube. Yeah, but but I think uh, but I think nowadays I think there really there isn't really a time limit on YouTube anymore. Yeah, thank God there isn't. All right, there we go. I got the skill point. Now, there's also another gold bolt here. I will show you. Let's see. Now. Um, oh.
Oh yeah, you have to jump down here and it will lead you to the Gadgetron employee break room. And this is where the Gobo is. As you see, this room has a lot of ends here. Right there we go. Okay, here is another skill point on this planet where you have to get over 4,500 points in a hoverboard race here. Okay, I'm gonna speed this up a little bit since this may take a while. Because, um, because the only way I can, like, continually do it is, like, to, um... Oh, well, this is not the ramp, but... Yeah, oh, wait, wait, hold on, hold on. But yeah, that is the ramp that I have to continually jump on to get the... to get the skill point. And this may take a while because I figured... because I have to figure out the button combination to get the... Like... Oh, you get to get a lot of points. Because to do that, I believe you have to, like, press, um, like, three or four buttons. Yeah, yeah, the L2, R2, L1, and... L and R1 buttons. Yeah. You gotta press like three or four of those to get like a lot of points. Here, yeah, let me speed it up right now. Okay, so here we are at that swimming section from Wilgar where where the water kept rising and we kept drowning. <coughs> but now no but worry no more about it now that we have the O2 mask. Okay, so there there is a gold bowl here. Now I will show you where it is. Oh yeah, just swim through there and go up, up, up. Oh yeah, like Patrick says, like like the way Patrick said it in, um, oh yeah, um, Sailor Ralph with SpongeBob SquarePants when he's playing Eels and Escalators with SpongeBob. Right, yeah, there we go, we got the gold bolt. Now, there is another, <laughs> excuse me, skill point I would like to show you. Yeah. Okay, now here, now this skill point, you have to do the hoverboard race in under 1 minute and 35 seconds. Well, in the PAL version, it's 1 minute and 36 seconds. So the, so the challenge is easier in the PAL version. Which, um, which this is why I wanted to get the PAL version for, for a minute, because, um, because I had trouble on this challenge for like over a year because um yeah yeah November of 2016 I was trying to do this challenge but then I had such a hard time doing it like man but then luckily I found a way to do it yeah and as you may have noticed um you see me falling to one side of the racetrack to get to 
another side. Yeah, that's kind of like warping, like, like, watch me do it again. Okay. I'll dash off to here. And see, like, see how I fall in there? And see how I ended up in another part of the course? Like, yeah, like, that is how the win faster. I mean, well, you'll see it again here. Yeah, see how I ended up, up here rather than where I jumped off? Like, wow. Like, I did not think of doing that until, like, three months ago, like, when I recorded this. Like, you can see the recording date, like, right there. I mean, you may have a hard time seeing it. Yeah. I can't believe I finally got it. Okay, here's another skill point here where you have to do a twisty big marks. Yeah, we least we have to press R1, R2, L1, and then L2, I think. Yeah, you have to, uh, yeah, I think you have to press any four of the shoulder buttons. Yeah. Okay, there we go, that was the skill point there. Okay, now here we are at the floor station. Now, we're in this part where you have to like to explore space. But now that we have to... But now that we have the O2 mask, we can go as Ratchet. Okay, now there is a Gobel here. Yeah. <laughs> it, it isn't possible for Clank to get any of the gold bolts, so... But now that we have the O2 mask, we can find it now. So what you have to do is just jump up to that platform right there. And there it is. Here we go. Okay, now, here we are in Orkson. Now, this is the skill, I mean, not the skill point, goal ball here that I was talking about where you have to use the visit bomb gun. Now, I'm gonna speed this up a little bit. Because this, this is gonna take long, yeah. Okay, there we go. The path to that gold bowl has been opened. Now, to find our way through. Okay, here we are in the room with the vending machine. Now, not only does, um... Okay, I forgot if I told you this, but, um, not only does the dispenser carry... ...carry premium nanotech, it also carries ultra nanotech. Because not only does it give us one more unit, It'll also give us three more units here. This dispenser also carries Ultra Nanotech, the very latest in Gadgetron technology. Ultra Nanotech is three times more potent than Premium Nanotech. So we do have more than enough bolts, so let's buy it. Did he just burp? Oh my god. 
Well, oh my god, that that isn't that is not good manners. He did not say excuse me. God, how rude does his burp even shook the screen? So yeah. Yeah, I can really tell that he's bad manners. Okay, so here we are at the Okay, at the path that we opened. Yeah, thanks to our visit bomb gun. Okay. Now. Now watch out for. Uh, now watch out for that ooze. Whoa! It just took away all our all our health. Like, oh my god! Even even our ultra nanotech that we just got. Like, oh my god! That is so. Like, come on, we haven't even met an enemy that takes away one unit of nanotech. So, oh my god, how ridiculous is that? Okay, there we go. We have made our way through. <laughs> okay, now here we are at Pokotaru. Now we can get that skill point where you have to destroy three jets. Yeah, think of this theory. Yeah, we did have the Vis Bomb gun, but the but then, um, we didn't have enough bolts to, like, fulfill our ammunition, like, just in case. This one ran right out. Anyway, I'll speed this up because this may take a bit of a while. I'm talking a little bit funny, by the way, because um, I have a bit of a cold. Okay, sorry if you heard me coughing as well. Alright, yes, um, I guess there is a part of the planet where, yeah, Gold Bowl is being held there. Okay, now, use your thruster pack to activate the switch here. Yeah, there we go. Wow, cool. Look how that bridge forms. Like, wow, that was cool. I wonder, have I, seen, have I seen a bridge like that in this world? Or at least a picture of it? Oh, come on, those stupid puffer fish. Ah, 
come on. Come on, just die already. Ah, good. Those TNT plates destroyed those puffer fish. Aw, oh, dang it. I'm out of Tesla Claw ammo. Well, I guess I might as well use the Morph Ray instead. Ah, oh, come on. I hate these things. Yeah, yeah, darn those things. Oh, come on! Oh, dang it. I have one nail to get it left. One out of eight. It's like, this is severe. Ah, oh, dang it. Alright, oh, we have to activate that switch again. Okay, good, good, good. I made my way through here. I'll see this. Okay, we are almost to the goal, right? Come on, we gotta... Yeah, there you go. Yeah, just die. Come on. Come on, guys. Feel the jolt. Wait, come on. Yeah, just die already. Okay, let's let's hold these little boxes here. Okay, there we go. Of course electricity won't do it. So yeah, something yeah, something physical has to do, has to destroy something like that. Not like some elemental attack. Like fire, thunder, lightning. <laughs> Okay, and there's the gold ball here. Here we are on planet Hoven. There is a skill point here where you have to destroy every ankle biter you see. Now that one is pretty straightforward because, um... Yeah, ankle biters do most of the fear or some of the areas here. But yeah, if you destroy every one of them, boom, you get the skill point here. So yeah, straightforward. that skill point and also if you go over here hold on can I do it right whoop let's stop let me try that again oh whoa, whoa, whoa. totally screwed up there because I jumped in the wrong direction I jumped off the rocks and not that thing that's moving okay now Ah, oh, I almost had that one. Just, there we go, come on, yes. Ah, oh, we're almost there. There we go, got it. Yep, there, there's a gold bolt there. Okay, there's a gold ball here in the Hydra Displacer puzzle area as well. We're gonna speed this up because this is gonna take... Yeah, kind of a long time.
Okay, now, now we're here on Planet Core 2. Now, remember that code bot we found on, um, Drex Fleet? Well, the code bot is for this planet, if I haven't told you yet. Well, I'll show you the door then. Um, yeah, the door is, like, right there. Yeah, let's make good use of it. There we go. Ooh, look at all those crates. More moolah! Ooh. Wow, look at all that. Alright. And here is another gold ball. Okay, here's a skill point on, on Planet Kerwin that you can earn for for destroying that blimp up there. Yes, the Visibom gun is required. Okay, here we are at Gemlik Base. We are here to finish the mission where we had to destroy those cargo ships. Yeah, yeah, the skill point was called Sitting Ducks. And I will show you the one we haven't gotten yet. Go, we got the skill point. All right. Okay, now let's get that gold bow we couldn't get on our first visit. Because to get that gold bow, like all missions have to be completed. So be careful not to touch that lava, which I just did. Man, you have to have like two nanotech or more if you want to get that gold bolt. Because I mean, like, like somehow touching the lava may be the only way to make it. I don't know, but anyway. So that is all we haven't collected. Alright, so in the next episode, we will take on Drek. Yeah, back at our home planet. Yeah, the planet we started. And now we're ending the game there. Alright, see you soon.